Okay, oh, so it's, it's, it's always put it's gone label. down to there. Okay, so yeah, so actually, okay, on this side, there, yeah, there's our line there. there okay. But I, 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 I imagine it would have been up here. So, um, so I think it would have been here. Oh, if really? you look at okay. So they vary. One of the things about this is that the actual volume in there varies quite a bit. If you, you can tell this. If you go home and weigh bottles of champagne, if you've got, we didn't do this. We could have done this. That's considered um, impolite. If if you don't weigh the champagne, champagne around and you start weighing it in front of them. I but mean. you'll see that there are that, you know, there's a tolerance like everything else. There is an allowed tolerance, and um, so they do vary a little bit. Do you know what we have? What? Stop champagne. Okay, um, I've got a spare. <laughs> right, so we can now we can get oh, you can take the this label measurement here, and yeah. we can get this measurement here. Yeah. So if you we'll if you take the, the lowest bit off. Right, so now we are, now I have to search my office oh, for a right, ruler. Oh, you're way up there. Look at that. Yeah. Um, I've got I've got a treasure chest back here that has got oh, everything except. Fit. What calculator are you? Oh, that's that was my univer. I sat my university exams with that calculator. Casio, good choice. Um, wow, this right. is old school. Yeah, I, th I, listen, you know, I, that's that's the Cambridge University, the this is allowed. You're allowed this. Yeah. I've still got a calculator with the UWA authorised to UA, use an exams sticker. Um. Right, so we have a diameter of 18 millimetres, give or take, and we're going to call that on the order of what? 10? 10 yeah. centimetres? I mean, some people use a ruler, not us. We're, we're taking, estimating, quite literally here, and we'll see what happens. Order of magnitude wise, we're fine. Uh, well, it's a shame that calculator. Does it, does it still work? Yeah, I haven't yeah. actually tried it for many years. I'm not sure so, it still switches on. What do you want to know? Does it? Yeah, okay, it's Wow. Okay, right, so we want um, 0 0.018. Uh, point, point one eight squared. Wait, hang on, wait, oh goodness, it's freaking out. Point. No, you want not one eight divided. Zero point zero one eight. Yep. Squared yep. divided by four. Squared divided by four. Yep. And multiplied by pi. Times pi. Uh, you got uh, two point five times ten to the negative four. Okay, so we're going to divide that by. Now we have. We're going to. That's our area. Do yeah. here, yeah. So we're going to uh, calculate the volume. We're going to say because we're going to make the assumption that that's a cylinder because it's not far off. In which case we can. In which case we right can. Down, right. So we can just right. do one over length. Right. So then we've basically got length squared. So because for the because we're going to be quick here. Yeah. We're going to ignore that we're bit. Throw that out. So we're going to oh. say that this is approximately two times. Uh, speed of sound in air over two. I can't write because you've sprayed oh, champagne. champagne. <laughs> I'm very sorry. <laughs> Divided by the square root of one over Length squared. 0 0.1 squared, which is uh, just 0. Point, divide that by 0. 0.1. So, uh, so what we can so it's basically 0. 0.2 pi on the bottom times the speed of sound on the top. So and um, we have said that this is um, so the speed of sound in air 22 degrees is around. 343, so we divide that by 0 0.2 pi. Uh, yeah, so find out what that is. Oh, sorry, 343. So 17, three, four, so it's about three, 500 and something, right? Divided by, in brackets, 0 0.2? 0 0.2 pi. 0 0.2 times pi. 510, exactly. 20? Go 546, 550. Okay, 546 hertz, which is wow, that's pretty close. Pretty close to 600. 600 hertz, yeah. Um, and it's, I know it's an approximation, and, the, and there are there will be harmonics that give you the the, the shape of the sound, yeah. but they'll only be, they'll all be at multiples of that. So that'll be about 500. They'll be at around 1,000, 1,500. So they're very much lower than 10 kilohertz. Yes. Um, but it's nice. So the thing about this that it, it, it first of all the useful thing should you wish to be rude at parties is that not only if you don't want to weigh the bottle as you arrive, you can record the pop, measure the bottle and see whether it was full or not. That's good. Um, which, well, it might be good depending on who your friends are. Uh, yeah. And whether you still want them to be your friends afterwards. <laughs> but it means if you don't know any one of these, yeah. you can work it out once you've got the frequency. Yeah, and as long as you can measure the inner radius in there. Oh, well, um, you can suddenly do that at a party. Yes. So, that, so the lovely thing is you get the number, it works, you can see it, and... Um, yeah, 